Hi Second Lifers, welcome back. This is part two of my review of Powder Pack. Um, I uh, stopped after doing the top row because I realised it was taking me ages and I thought it better to do it in um, three segments. So I'm going to try and be a little bit quicker on the next two, I promise, okay? So we're on this second line now. So that means we've got goodies to look forward to from Essences. Just Magnetised, Lettre and Modish or Modish. So let's open Essences first of all and see what we get. Powder Pack January 2017 from Essences. Okay, so I'm going to detach that hood. Um, while I was away, I had a little play with the Omega Applier for the um, skin. The uh, rather beautiful Matilde skin by Elysium, which I have fallen in love with. And um, I've gone for the freckly option, and as you can see, it's fab. I'm loving it. I love the makeups, I love everything about it. I am a happy kitty at the moment. So, let's see what this is. Add. Okay. Just cut that for the moment. And that. Click to unpack. I do love nice presentation on items. It does make me a very happy kitty. Okay, so Essences Powder Pack, Jan 2017. So we've got Lara Appliers Dark, Medium and Pale Indigo. There's a shape as well. Dark, Medium and Pale Catwork Applier. So before we do any of that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in here and reluctantly clean my face. So, brows, clear the eye makeup. Yeah, that's you. You shut your mouth and salt, love. That's exactly how I feel. Take off that glorious red pout. <sighs> Even without makeup on, though, this skin looks good. So we are happy. Okay, so essences. Let's have a look then. We've got dark, medium, and pale. So I'm going to go for medium. Let's see what this looks like this out of the way so you've got rather a straightforward hood there with different colored brow options and no brow so let's go for brown see what this looks like I'm waiting for it to resin Wow again very very different to the previous skins that we've been using this one is what I would say is a very stylized skin. Um, I'm just going to try the brows in black. See what that looks like. And I'm going to add the Maitreya Lara Applier as well. I've never worn an essence of skin before. So this is completely new to me. I'll tell you what though, you get some different options with them that I've never, I mean, you can get different pubic hair. Look at all this. What's all this about? That's unbelievable. Okay, small chest, cleavage, cleavage, small chest. Let's go for cleavage. See what happens. Looks okay, doesn't it? Oh, let's try that one. Let's try small chest, see how that looks. Okay, I prefer that actually to the cleavage one. It's very different to what I would normally wear. Now that doesn't mean that I dislike it. It's very, you look at this and Right, it doesn't have the element of what's the word I'm looking for? Realism that the other ones that I previously tried have. This is very stylized, but I like it. And I really want to have a look at my pubes, but I know for a fact that if I take my pants off, it'll take me all afternoon to find them in my uh, inventory. So, what I am going to do is I'm going to have a look about with this and just try some different lash styles with this skin. 
see what it looks like. What do you think? I think it's great actually. Those brows are very unusual. But it doesn't mean I don't like them. I do like them. They're very striking because they're just they're so thick and they're so drawn on. But they work. I like the texture on the lips that's been applied and they're nice and big and pouty. Let's see if I can put some lipstick on. Just using the regular um catwa menu. Wow, I think it looks better with with lipstick on, I really do. I like this. Again, it's not a skin I would ever go for. It really isn't because if I'm if I'm brutally honest, I would see a picture of those brows and think that's not for me. But now that I'm wearing it, I actually really like it. I really do like it. Yeah. I do. I'm happy with that. I think it's lovely. I think it looks good with some eye makeup on and some really strong liner. It's it's a nice skin. I like the fact that um, it comes with uh, a no brow option. I think the other two did as well. I didn't highlight it, so sorry, that's me being useless. Um, but it's good because I'm looking at red, red brows because um, it allows you to add your favourite brows. And there's quite a few places in the world that do really good brows, and that looks amazing. Okay, I think this would apply itself really well to kind of sci fi and crazy hair colours and that kind of thing. Because that red is really bold and it looks really, really effective. Oh, look at Ginger. <laughs> this is great. As I said earlier, I'm trying different things that I wouldn't normally try purely because of this box, and that's the whole point of them. <laughs> it's great fun. Happy Kitty is happy. Yeah, we like. I'm pl I'm pleased with this. It's good. It's a good skin. It really does work with that black brow, though. I think that's the way I would wear it with that black brow. It's beautiful. Yes, I'm pleased with that. It's not what I imagined it would be like. It's not something that I ever thought I'd wear, but it works. So, what more do you want? So that's the essences, and I'm pleased with that immensely. Okay, so moving swiftly on, let's have a look what's next. And um, we've got Just Magnetised. Now, I love Just Magnetised stuff. I love Just Magnetised and Laetra very much. I do wear the pliers and makeups and hair bases from them, so I'm looking for something exciting in this. Basic Hair Base Special Edition 01. So let's have a look what basic hair base special edition I want is going to be. Can't see it looking. Okay, there we go. Accept. If you can hear a noise in the background, it's a cat. Apologies. Just magnetised. Okay, basic hair base. Special edition 01 for Cat West. Let's just add that. I have got a just magnetised hair base that I wear a hell of a lot. Oh, that's good. It comes in all the colours, so that's going to be useful. Okay, let's try black. Hair base layer, do you want to pile this on? I don't know. Let's try lower. Is that how it's supposed to look? I presume that's how it's supposed to look. Is that right? I don't know. I think it might need blending in. What do you think? I think it does. Okay, let's have a look. Um, this is where it all goes horribly, horribly wrong for me. Hair, blend, mask, blend, mask, clear. Okay, nothing's happening. 
or sometimes the brush layer affects it. Clear, blend, but not in this case. Okay, I have absolutely no idea if I've oh, so I've definitely done something to it because it's much more striking there, isn't it? Okay, let's have a look. Blend, mask, blend, ah, clear. What about that? Oh god, it's hard being me. Yeah. I think I've just realised what I've done here. I didn't know about that. But hey, we're learning. Let's try it on upper next time. So let's click that. Upper. Ah, right, okay. Why is an unusual hair base? So, can we change the colour of it, upper? Oh, that's me. Do, do first. There you go. Um, I'm still not 100% sure that I'm doing it right, if I'm being brutally honest. I don't think I am, to be fair. I think I'm making a bit of an arse of this. So please forgive me. Try it again. Upper. It's certainly a very striking hair base. And I will say that it goes with this skin incredibly well because it's got that striking element to it but I would need more time to sit and play about and work out what I'm doing wrong with it which is clearly something however I do like it it's unusual and the back's nice and neat as well so I will use that I just don't know how at the moment full disclosure there not sure what I'm doing but hey at least I'm honest. Moving swiftly on then. What have we got next? So pack back. So we've had those two. Let's have a look what we've got from La Etre. Cobra lipsticks. Fat pack. I do like a good lipstick. add so straight into a hood click me to unpack I have unpacked I will detach that cobra lipsticks fat pack so let's have a look at the palette then so these are mats and they're funny enough they're a bit Kat Von D aren't they so let's try number two. Add. Uh -huh. So it brings up an apply button. Click me to apply, which I just did. That's a nice colour, isn't it? And of course, remember, you can make it look darker. Oh, oh my days. There you go. Look at that. Yeah, we like. That's gorgeous. What a fantastic colour. Oh, we wear the shit out of that in real life, let alone second life. Okay, let's try another one. We'll go for number four to apply see what this one is I've taken the lipstick palette down it's a more classic red but it's lovely there's a real depth to that red I'm very impressed with these I'm such a sucker for a red lipstick but that is gorgeous and it looks really nice on these lips don't you think 
yeah we're liking this let's try number nine let's get rid of that one first try number nine okay let's have a look click me to apply Oh, very goth, very, very purple, dramatic, very, very lovely, I like that very much, um, let's just change, oh god that's so pretty as well, let's just change the uh, mouth position, yeah that's lovely, it's very nice, okay let's try number 10 as well, I've not tried all of them obviously but I know this one's black so I want to see it, oops, don't think I detached. So let's try again. Black. Just like my heart. Ha 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 ha. Oh, that's nice too. Let's have a zoom in, shall we, and see what the edges are like for feathering and stuff. They're pretty okay, actually. Nothing wrong with that at all. So pretty basic lipstick appliers but they look great better than on Kylie Jenner anyway if you ask me but hey what do I know yeah I like I like although that hair base is bugging me but hey that's my own fault I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing there so we've had number three so let's move on to number four. We're on this line, so it's modish or modish or whatever. Nina powder pack. Let's see what Nina is then. I has an excite. What could Nina be? So look for modish in there. Let's just add that. Uh, it's giving me a box to wear, hasn't it? I'll just detach that. I'll just press it on the ground. Nina. January hood. Okay, so we've got a hood straight into a hood there then. Delete that. What have we got here? Ooh. Nina powder pack. So, straight into skins then. So, I'm going to go back in here and just take off that lipstick. Okay. Let's have a look then. So, here comes Nina. What shall I go for? I'm going to go for that one. Oh. It's just makeup um, appliers, obviously. So let me take, go back here and let me go to browse. Browse. Let me just clear that down. I think what I need to do actually is go to a skin that's not got brows on. So let's go to the one I'm just currently wearing anyway. So we go to Essences, well, that's a medium cat, cat wet applier, I'll do no brow, okay, so then we can try Nina properly. Oh it's not so freaky when you've not got brows on. Okay, so there's loads of different colours here, so let's go for that one that was trying before anyway. very thick and they look very drawn in they look like somebody's been going out in the face with a wonder brow don't they <laughs> darks tans and fairs let's try some lips as well oh i like that one and the lips are good too Hmm, what do we think? Okay, let's try a different colour lipstick. 
let's try a different colour brow. I get the feeling these are going to be very useful with um, particularly different blonde and ginger shades of hair. I like the lipstick colours very, very much. I'm not sure if I'm completely sold on the brows, if I'm brutally honest. They do look good, but they're a little bit too thick for, for my kind of preference. I'll definitely get some use out of these lip colours though, because they're incredibly nice. if I was to wear any of the brows from here it would be the darker ones brows blend can we darken that even more yes we can let's have a look for me it looks much better to my own personal taste when it's really really dark but even then I don't know if I, I like that one I just don't know if I'm completely sold on the shape this red again I like that better now actually looking at it a second time I don't know I don't know if I'd wear them a lot I think there's a lot of people that certainly would and there's, uh, there's absolutely nothing wrong with them but to my own personal taste I think I'm going to probably get more use out of them I mean, oh my god look at that lipstick that's beautiful it's like a pale coral I think I'll get more use out of the lipsticks in this palette than I will than with the brows I'm very drawn to these three colours here they're very nice oh that's lovely yeah no I like the lips incredibly incredibly well they're, they're very good not so keen on the brows but hey that's just me so that is the second row done of powder pack where is it where is it where is it so this is video number two drawing to a close so we've done essences just magnetized la etre and modish we've got okay bye Pink Fuel, Slack Girl and Zibska to come and also a surprise gift. So I will upload this one and then we'll see what the last row has got in store for us. Toodaloo!